Hi y'all, um, I just got back home from a doctor's appointment. Everything is everywhere. It's kind of cool in here. I'll cover with this. I just got back from a doctor's appointment and they do my blood and I will take this off right now as we're speaking. Ah. <laughs> I must say, being a certified um, phlebotomist, because I am certified, I mean, we didn't get the certificate yet, but we completed the course and we all passed, so we're certified. Um, I paid way more attention when the girl was drawing my blood. She, her hands were so gentle, she was great. So, um, I, they did blood tests because they're trying to do like potassium and this and that and whatever. I've been staying off of potatoes for about a month at this point and then I had a pap smear done. So I go back in two weeks again. I'm beginning to think I'm there too often. I just feel a little drained to be honest. I don't know. I had to um, fast for that appointment and so I hadn't eaten anything all day. When I got home was after 11.30. So I made a big breakfast. I'm gonna prep it on here so you guys can see what I was having, but I decided to do it big because no yam, no pam. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I ate that and I really am gonna just chill on the couch because I'm off today, I work tomorrow, and then I'm off Saturday again, which is good. Maybe tomorrow I'll go and see if they need anyone for Saturday. Yeah, I'll do that. Do I wanna do that? Cause next week I'm working. I think six days next week Friday I'm gonna be doing my PCT license exam so that oh I want Quizlet practicing some questions and stuff but um yeah so next week I'm working six days so I'm gonna take that day off tomorrow and my doctor gave me some medication and she was like Janine what am I gonna do with you your blood pressure is still high <coughs> and I think she said she gave me a motopine and she gave me like the lowest dose, I think 2.5 milligrams. And she said that that doesn't give you, that's like one of the oldest forms of blood pressure medication. And um, in terms of like side effects, that one does not have, <coughs> excuse me, that one does not have that many side effects. And so far the side effects that she has seen is like, um, well, she didn't tell me that I came home and TikTok it. Um, swollen ankles, but they're saying that normally when you get swollen ankles is from like a higher dosage But she's saying listen, you're young and um, It's a little high even if people's baselines are different. This is high for your age So I'm gonna start taking it So I think I'm gonna put it on the kitchen table so I can remember to take it She said to check my blood pressure in the morning take the pill and then check check again in the afternoon so we're gonna try that and see but um for the most part, that really is all. It was an early appointment, which I'm got no food because I'm fasting. Mark is complete. Oh, <clears throat> I came in here because I wanted to move things around a little bit. The living room is looking a mess right now, to be completely honest. But I wanted to move things around a little bit. So let's try that. Battery dying, so I'm gonna have to change that and throw this out. So give me a minute. I bought this refinishing spray for the bathroom tub. 
I need to read the directions to see how you apply it. And then I bought this seal for like around the, where the tub and the wall meets. Um, this one is very expensive, so I really hope the f that it, the shit works. I gotta see how many hours you gotta give it to dry. Which means maybe right now is a good time to put it on. 15 minutes, what? This shit is in Spanish. I hope some part of it is in English. Or I'm gonna have to let Mr. Reed and tell me what it's saying. Because luckily for me, he speaks Spanish here to there. But I'm gonna read this and figure that out. I've been studying for my upcoming exam. I slept, woke up, and just was studying this whole time. So we're gonna see how this works because we both already took showers to see if I can like put it on right now. Hello, you guys. I don't even know what to do with y'all. Okay, let's put y'all here. Just got home from work. Just got home from work. And I got a package that I'm so excited about because one, whew, I didn't know that I was gonna get it now. Oh, cutest little package. All right, let's put this here. I'm so tired and I'm literally starving. Gloves in my pocket, always. Assignment sheet, don't need that. So this is like a little keychain from Coach. So excited. I did not expect it to come now, honestly. And then I got something from Amazon. Just a cute little keychain. And it has like, so I can like just attach that to my key and I know that it's like good quality so it's gonna last me a very long time. This one was originally $58, but I bought it on Couch Coach Outlet for I think $23. If you're gonna buy from, from Coach, always buy from the outlet. This is so cute. Love that. So I'm gonna add it to my key right now. I think I'll put it here. Such good quality. I'm tired of buying like a cheap keychain or whatever or not. So I love that this is like a decent quality. Literally all that I needed. I also got a tray for like when you're taking baths. So cute. It's in this little package. Let me see if I can pop it out real quick and show it to y'all. I don't know where my box cutter is. I haven't seen that thing in weeks. So this is what it looks like. I love it. And it came with a little brush for like dry brushing to like brush dead skin. Love that. And you could extend it. So I'm very excited to use this when I take a bath. Super cute. And like a little soap dish, I suppose. Absolutely do not know what this adhesive is. But we're keeping it. Not lose any pieces, Jenny. So like I said, you're able to extend it and you have like a little part where you can put your like iPad or your laptop and you extend it this way. Is it gonna fall off? You extend it this way and obviously you have to pull that down depending on the size of your bath. The dry brush is here. So, so cute. So love that. Can't wait to use it. So this is gonna live in the bathroom, I suppose. Not that I have space for it or anything, but I felt like I needed that. I can bring a glass of wine with me when I'm taking a little bubble bath. So exciting. And that is really it on this week's episode of What Janine Bought. I'm gonna change out of my scrubs and I have a few things that I have to do. Jules is on another level. We just, um, Mr. just picked me up from work. Picked me and Jules up. Dropped her at the nail salon. Up me, he'll know what about his business. I'm gonna warm up some chicken that we had from last night. Oh, last night. Last night, I went on the road with him, all because he promised to buy me food. It's very easy to make me happy. All you have to do is feed me. We bought three pieces of chicken and I ate one and we bought some mac and cheese. And the mac and cheese is literally slamming. I think I'm gonna eat the rest of the chicken right now. So I'm gonna just pop those in the microwave. You guys, when I went to my doctor's appointment the other day, the doctor was like, Janine, your blood pressure is still high. What is going on? And I'm like, honestly, I did not take any of the medication that you gave me. And she's like, what? None at all? And I'm like, no, because I just feel like I don't want to be on it for the rest of my life. And she's like, 
Janine, what am I gonna do with you? <laughs> I don't know, I'm afraid. She said I gave you the lowest dosage possible. And um, you know, it's very important that you take it because for your age, it's very high. And that could be bad, you know? So a girl is not trying to tap out in life. So I'm gonna take it. Today I took one. I feel like it made me very hot. That could be all in my head because today was a warmer day. But that's really all. So we're warming up some food, gonna change out of the scrubs. I bought something for the bathroom. I think I vlogged it yesterday, it's still pretty much spray paint the bathroom, so good the top. So I need to figure that out to see if I can do that. Anyways, I'll later y'all. I got a lot going on right now and I'm starving, so I'm a little bit discombobulated, so later.